What's up guys? Um, so it's Tuesday and uh, thanks to salary jobs, I'm going to try to sneak out and uh, hunt the same kind of spot I've been going to the past however many days. Um, I'm going to sneak over here to my uh, neighbors who's been nice enough to let me hunt at their property, on their property. Anyways, I've hunted back there a couple of times already this year and I've seen uh, several deer. Um, but I also have pictures of a pretty nice buck as well, so um, I don't know. I mean, I kind of feel like I've been in there a lot, but I have a, a bunch of stuff I can, you know, work I can do actually from my phone, so. Why sit in an office chair when you can sit in a tree stand? You fool! Yeah, I put corn out over there a couple days ago. And from what, what I've kind of noticed is past couple years, like a handful of spots that um, I bait a lot. It seems like within a day or two, like within 24 hours generally, if you put corn out, it seems like, bam, like they're on it right away. So um, I think I baited the spot like two days ago. I'm, ho I'm hoping they will have already gotten in there and found it but i'd like to shoot a big old fat doe but i guess we'll check my camera and kind of see not that it really works but whatever
this spot is so wide open. The baby came running in, being all weird, like a big, big puppy dog. And then the mama came out behind her, and she was facing me. She was eating corn, eating corn, eating corn. I, I picked up my right arm like this, just a little bit, and she pecked me immediately. I couldn't believe it. And I was really slow when I did it, and it weirded her out. And she started backing up, and then she bent to my left, and I had a little window. I tried to get the camera back on her before I drew. My bow, my, my, my bow set to 20 yards. I guessed it at 30, right at 30. So I aimed to touch high, but I knew she was gonna bolt. I also knew because of how freaked out she was, she would probably duck, but it looked like a heart shot. It, there, I, I, I very realistically could have missed her and hit low, but I heard a big crash. And the other thing is, is I didn't hear either of them blow. But I heard a bunch of walking afterwards, which usually means the other one's trying to figure out what's wrong with the one that's, if it's dead, is walking around the, the freaking dead one. So I'll wait a little bit. It's starting to get cool out. It sounds like she didn't run far. It sounds like they just kind of, just kind of like bent over to the left a little bit. If there's blood on the arrow, she's dead right there. If there's nothing on the arrow, then I missed her. My gut reaction as I drilled her. My gut reaction is she's dead. See my luminoc right over there. So I'm gonna hang tight. I'm gonna give it a little bit longer and I'm gonna walk over and check my arrow. <clears throat> what? What? Working from home, baby. What? Hopefully, I'm about to be 2 0. Let's go. shot. What? What? Alright, let's look for some blood. Here she is. Man. Jeez, old Pete. Holy cow. Good gosh.
I started the blood trail and I freaking totally lost the blood trail. And I kind of circled, I kind of just started grid searching. I, I had a really good idea where I thought she wiped out, but um, she's big, man. She's a lot bigger than I thought she was. That's a big old doe. So let's go. Let's get her out of here, man. Oh, what's up? We got her out of here. Here she is. She's a great big giant thing, man. <clears throat> she only ran like, I don't know, 70 yards. I heard her crash, but what was wild was like, I completely lost the blood trail. I had it, I had it, I had it. It was good, it was good, it was good. And all of a sudden like nothing, just like disappeared like a freaking ghost. So, I uh, just kind of walked towards where I thought she was, which I don't advise doing to uh, for, for people. But it sounded like she crashed and I was pr pretty confident in the shot. And um, sure enough, I found her laying there and I got up on her. I mean, like I said, Jiminy Christmas. She is huge. So, um, gross. So anyways, I'm gonna get her cut up. It's freaking Tuesday. And I have tons of work I have to do tomorrow, so I kinda have no other choice, but I have to completely butcher her by myself tonight. It's nine o'clock. So <laughs> I wish I had some help, but everybody else has to work too. So I'm glad I got her, but kind of a weird decision to make to just freaking go hunt because I had an extra hour, but glad I got her. I was so surprised at the shot I drilled her when I gutted her I found there was just a perfect triangle through the heart so it's a good feeling I'm 2-0 and baby stick around we have a, a really cool couple episodes coming up um, Luke Chrissy Aaron hopefully Jamie maybe my buddy Trevor I don't know. Or I have all kinds of stuff going on, so stick around. Thanks for watching. So horrible.